Hello, this is Mike of Neil Enough Dice, and this is the Kerbal Space Program. This here is my uh, asteroid capture. It's actually upside down for some reason, but that's that's where I, I came in. Uh, let's go and check my fuel situation. I'm particularly interested in my electric charge situation. That's that's the biggest problem that I would have. Um, uh, where is the yeah? So I've got. Oh, the separation was better before. To be perfectly honest. Separation has changed. Um, that may still be the best I'm going to get. Um, I'm pretty sure that is not the manoeuvre that I had. The manoeuvre that I had was better than this. Uh. Oh, so wish you could focus um, on either on you know, on asteroids. You can't. I can't do the focus view thing, so I can I can't see where I'm going to end up. So I don't know whether it's just the the physics engine being less um, accurate. So now I can't remember. Oh well. Hmm. I thought I'd I'd arranged myself quite a nice um manoeuvre. One six one one sixty. And now apparently not. Um you can see that I'm I'm suddenly much higher up above my in fact my blue orbit is closer at that point than my proposed orbit so um one fifty five four seven that's mildly irritating. So now I don't know what I want to do. I don't know whether I want to keep that. That. Um, I don't know if I want to keep that at all now. I had this lovely, delicate maneuver when last I, I saw this, um, which now isn't going to work at all. Or it's still. I mean, I, I could possibly do a mid-course correction and get something useful out of it, but um, possibly not. Versus what I would, yeah what I would particularly like um, is a in the in this rendezvous section is an estimated you know I would love to be able to get those two intercepts I would love to get that information so I'm currently ahead of them. Oh. So it looks like I'm going to have to actually set that maneuver completely, completely from scratch because I did have a much better maneuver. You can see that's quite close, but it's still over a million kilometres. So unless I want to do something way over there, I don't know what I can, uh, what I can usefully do. 
Oh, what a pain! I, I had, I had my, I had my day planned out. Like I knew what was going to happen. And now I do not. Um, yeah, things I would love to be able to do. I would love to be able to change my my view focus, so that uh, we are all, we are you, know, you automatically go to you know uh, uh, your intercept one position, say. And that's where the camera now rotates around. That would be brilliant. The thing is, that's those separations look much wider than I think they are. Oh, much more different. That's one million one fifty-five. That's one million. I mean, I don't. They, I think they're actually pretty similar. Right. Let's. Let's. Yeah. Focus sun. I think. Uh. Yeah. Okay. Focus sun. I think that's going to be a little bit easier. So, um, yeah, instead of what I thought was going to happen, which is I'm now going to just quickly, um, I, you know, I know exactly what I'm going to be doing. Um, now I have no idea because now, and now it looks like I'm going to have to. Completely alter what I've, what my my orbits is going to do. So I'm going to see if I can't get to that uh, that intercept. And this is where if I could just like click on that and have that, you know, like I can with with apoapsis, it'll it'll stay up permanently if I do that. This won't. So I have to go. I have to click each time. One five ninety three five two. One five ninety. So that's going. Oh, that's going. So I am. I am improving by doing that. One five six five. Six three. So let's go up. That one from one four nine seven. One f okay, so I'm still going in the right direction. One four eight three. One four seven eight. Seven. Ooh, hang on. Oh no, it's seven eight, and then I went to seven four. Seven eight. So I wouldn't have bothered because I thought I had I thought I had a, a nice decent intercept. Uh, initially, it would it would have taken me around a whole orbit, but um, regardless. Uh, oh, hang on, was I getting further away? Five nine. Well, I'm getting uh, I'm getting I'm I'll be getting close now to as good as I can get at. With just u by using my um, five nine three nine four by using the apple abscess one five nine right so that's worse right so one five nine three nine four one five nine four one three so that's worse and one five nine five eight four so that's worse. So that's the best I can do just by 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 fiddling with my apple apps my my prograde vector. So I'm going to start playing with my normal vector. So that was worse. Uh, let's go back. Three, nine, four. Right. One, four, five, nine, three, nine, four. One, five, nine. Right, so that was worse. One, four, Five four eight, so that's better. One five four eight. 
I can't remember what I had before. Yeah, that was better. Uh, one, four, five, seven. Okay, so I'm improving things this way. I really wonder if I wanted. Um, I might want to. If I could, if I can calculate these values in KOS. Not that I've got a KOS on this particular machine. This might be a, a, a exactly what you want KOS for. So you basically, um, on on program normal and radial, you just add an amount and see which uh, has the biggest effect on in, um, in improving your. Um, Uh, improving your your intercept. So at the moment, radial is helping me. So I just look at the other one for no good reason. Ba, 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 ba. One three three five eight two. Right, so that's worse. Right, so that's as good as I'm getting with that. Uh, I'm missing that's on on tens. I can probably refine it. It's one three three five eight two. That gives me something. Oh, what just happened? What th one, one three five five? If I take away, okay, that's helping me. So we'll do that. Three, four, nine, four, seven. So it's just basically a case of, you know, just gradually seeing if I can't home in um, on an intercept that will work. But The fact that it's one, that it's changing my um, uh, view every so often just isn't helping. One, three, four, two. Right, so I think that's the best I'm getting. So again, I just I just fiddle that. Um, this is rather irritating. I thought, I mean, I I seriously thought I had um, sorted. Um, myself a nice intercept but uh, when I came back suddenly it wasn't there anymore it was all just different and I don't know why I don't know why that would happen I oh, don't do that oh that's quite good that makes a change So theoretically, you could you could come up with a you know a, a set of algorithms that uh, just kind of do a gradual walk towards um, a better separation or a, or, a, or a lower separation. Just quickly changing each of these values, seeing what the proposed intersect would be. Um, And then working on those. One nine thirty, one nineteen. I mean, this is still in the millions of kilometers kind of uh, range. So. One eighty 
so I'm still getting lower. 1071, 1063, 1047. Oh, this is all very exciting. I get it to within less than a million kilometers. Right, so I'm gonna have to fiddle with this and that's gonna take a little bit of time. So um, I will I will pause while I fiddle. Right, what I've decided to do uh, is wonder why my craft's not moving. We are moving just very slowly. All right, I'll just point it towards the maneuver node. That's I have a core that's smart enough to do that, so let's put the RCS on actually. There we go. So um, I have a maneuver and I'll bring up the alarm clock again. And we'll just remove that because I think I've I think I've um whoa 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 Get rid of those two. Ah, no! Ah, God, what the hell? Oh, I see. Uh, the click goes through the the panel into the the world below where I had warped to maneuver node set. Well, I was clicking. I was accidentally clicking warped to maneuver node. That was really irritating. Right, let's get rid of that. Put that back in. Right, so that is now the warp to the actual maneuver node. Because uh, I wasn't sure, because I, I, I changed the exact timing of it. So, um, the old alarm might not have been quite right. Oh, uh, what the hell? Why did it? I didn't have a burn margin. I don't know why. Sometimes um, it defaults to not having a burn margin, and I don't know why that is. And that's really irritating, which might mean that I'm not going to get the maneuver one. Anyway! Ah! That's really annoying. Right, so I've got a two minute burn. I'm using up an awful lot of my Delta V, so I'm, I, I think this mission is going to be a failure, because I'm not. I very much doubt I'm going to have enough Delta V to actually get there. But basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to use, I'm going to do this burn and that should get me somewhere close. And then there's a, I've got an ascending node in between the two. Um, And I'm hoping that I'll be able to do a maneuver there that'll get me even closer. But I'm not, I am, there is no way I'm going to have enough Delta V. Um, unless it counts the Delta V that's in the, um, in the RCS. And I don't know if that actually does count. I'm just I'm just maneuvering very far away so we don't have the enormous racket of the I might just have to mute the the game volume for a bit right I've also muted the speakers because my lord that's loud um actually I've no idea if you can hear me. No idea at all. But I kind of need to be in map mode. 
uh, to see um, what's going on. So I've got a theoretical 24,000 kilometer um, maneuver node, and then I've got I've got that ascending node there. Uh, another 30 seconds of this. Uh, so I'm hoping to just kind of feel my way. I think I think this mission is not going to succeed. I, I don't think I know enough about how to get to an asteroid quickly. Um, I might have to check out the mission that actually comes with, um, which comes with the game. Um, well, an asteroid redirect, which might give me some hints and tips. Right, okay, so... Right, we're just going to assume, let's see what damage I've done. Oh, now I'm not getting now I'm not getting that at all. What what is that? Uh, so now I'm not getting that even slightly. Um, brilliant. Well, I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing at all. So I'm currently too far ahead of my asteroid, which I can't even see. There we go. Yeah, I'm ahead of it. So really, I want to. I want to get outside of it uh, to slow down, such that I can. Uh, get close. So I wonder if I just, if I have, I did I just leave too early? Uh, I mean, I there's there's so many things. I just don't know if I, what I've done wrong. And I'm just going to make things worse because my orbit is now very much inside. So maybe I just need to go progress with it. I don't know what I'm doing. I think I'm just going to have to start declaring this mission a complete failure. Is that going up or is that going down? So there we go. So I've very briefly got my, my maneuver node back, my, my intercept back, but. Yeah, I think this is a failure. That's going ahead. That's going up now. So, given that um, there's nothing I can at this point do that's going to make things worse, that's why intercept two is in there somewhere. So it's going up. So if I go. But I, I noticed that 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 the that that spinning, um, given I'm using my, I suspect it's because I'm using my um, RCS. Wow. I just make and just make things worse. Well, I clearly don't know how to rendezvous with asteroids. I think it's the only uh, conclusion I can come to. I'm running out of delta v, and I'm not going to make it. So there you go. On that very positive and happy note, <laughs> we're 
Rendezvous with asteroids turns out to be hard. I think I'm gonna have to give up on this asteroid and go find another one. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, so uh, I do hope you've been enjoying watching me uh, fail to fail completely to, to capture an asteroid. Um, do hit like and subscribe if you want to watch more of me failing to um, get to an asteroid. Um, you can find Nearly Enough Dice at nearlyenoughdice.com. You can also find us on Twitter and Facebook. And until next time, um, reach for the stars, uh, hopefully with slightly more success than I've had today.